Welcome to Cloud Infrastructure Services YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to talk about the best top 10 G1 to desktop environments which are based on the version 20.04 and 22.04. So let's get started with the first one. At number 1 we have the KDE Plasma. Now, the KDE Plasma desktop is a fast and efficient widget based desktop environment which is easy to adapt. Users can quickly add, remove and move elements as per their requirements. It is a feature packed environment that uses just a few resources. Best thing is that Plasma is highly customizable so it can suit your taste. You can download custom widgets to the desktop panel in no time and use the KRunner launcher as a command line tool to execute shell commands or open and close apps quickly. At number 2, we have the Genome. Now this Genome stands for GNU Network Object Model Environment. It is one of the very popular Linux distributions around the world comprising the FOSL which stands for free and open source software. Now it is not only reliable, easy to use and has a minimalistic yet powerful interface. And after KDE, it is one of the best desktop environments to use for its feature rich and well integrated nature. Now it supports a full set of native applications and it is a highly customizable environment which uses extensions to expand its functionality to a whole different level. Number 3 on our list is actually Cinnamon. Now Cinnamon is a desktop environment is very beginner friendly for people who are new to Linux. It is a Cinnamon Spices repository with hundreds of add-ons which you can install to expand its functionality. Now it supports various dexlets, applets and even themes and extensions to offer a mature user experience. Cinnamon is very easy to get a hold of and is indeed one of the most popular Ubuntu environments out there. This Linux Mint community has built this finely forked graphical shell by customizing and modifying the Genome 3 shell. At number 4, we have the Mate. The Mate desktop environment is nothing but a fork and continuation of Genome 2. It is an interactive and highly intuitive desktop environment which uses traditional metaphors for not just Linux but also other Unix-like operating systems. It is the best choice for people who like the Genome 2. Mate is a fairly lightweight Linux desktop environment with an attractive and intuitive GUI. And the best thing about Mate is that it does not eat up much hardware resources and can run on budget machine easily. Number 5 on our list is XFCE. Now XFCE is a lightweight and stable desktop environment that is low on system resources. Now it has been around for nearly two decades now, XFCE may lack like special effects and animation but comprises crucial features, components and functionality users often expect from a lightweight desktop environment. Again, it consumes less hardware resources yet offers a user-friendly and visually enchanting interface. For customization, it offers numerous plugins and applications which you can install to extend its functionality even more. At number 6 on our list, we have Deepin. Now, Deepin Desktop Environment or DDE is a reliable and visually alluring environment developed by the Deepin Technology Limited. It features a full set of applications pre-installed to suit your daily domestic recreational activities as well as the office use activities. Now, it almost looks and feels like a Mac OS, hence most users are attracted towards it. Apart from its pleasant GUI, it offers a beautiful layout and intuitive animations. Now, number 7 on our list is actually Pantheon. Now, those who have used elementary OS Linux distros may already know Pantheon. Pantheon is a desktop environment that is coupled with the elementary OS. It is a thoughtfully designed environment built for Mac OS and Windows. Now, this platform is open source built on FOSS and is beginner friendly, using Vala and GTK3 toolkit offering a high polished look. However, it uses low hardware resources and aims to reduce the need to use the command line. Now, number 8 on our list is actually LXQT. Now, LXQT stands for Lightweight QT, which obviously means a lightweight desktop environment, offering a modern jet classic look. Now, it is available for most BSD and Linux distros. The components and application in LXQT are built using QT and KDE Framework 5. It does not flaunt highly attractive GUI, but it is known to run easily on older machines with low hardware resources. And it is a great alternative to XFCE. Now, number 9 on our list is actually Budgie. Now, Budgie is a luxurious desktop environment based on Genome. Hence, it is very light, stable and fast. It has a genome-like modern look and feel with amazing simplicity, elegance and efficiency. Utility in this environment is what makes it most popular. Now, Ubuntu Budgie is an official Ubuntu flavor featuring the Budgie desktop environment by default. Number 10 on our list is actually Enlightenment. Now, Enlightenment is a desktop shell that has basic functionalities such as launching application, managing windows and performing system tasks. But it does not include a full suite of applications. Enlightenment is built upon EFL which means Enlightenment Foundation Libraries, which you can even use independently or build on top of each other to create powerful applications or new features. Anyways, 
that was our list for top 10 Ubuntu desktop environments. Now if you still want to read more about these top 10 lists then you can simply check out the blog linked in the description box. And if you have learned anything new with this video make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel.